dear students in this video i am going to start new topic numerical solution of initial value problem this is your last topic fine so now here an ordinary differential equation is a relation between a function its derivatives and the variable upon which they depend fine so generally a differential equation involves the derivatives dependent variable and independent variable fine so the general form of an ordinary differential equation is given by od means ordinary differential equation this is given by phi x independent variable dependent variable y its derivatives first order second order and mth order this is equals to this is a general differential equation fine now here where m represents the highest order derivative of y with respect to x fine now an od is linear if the unknown function and its derivative appear to power 1 that means if the first maximum derivative is 1 then this is linear fine no product of the function unknown function and or its derivatives for linearity there is no product between the dependent variable and derivatives there is no power involved so only simple linear term should be involved then the od is known as linear otherwise od is non linear and this is these are the examples for example in the first one the highest derivative is 1 second thing is there is no product there is no product of dy by dx with some other dependent function this is linear this is also linear there is no product that's why this is linear in the second one highest order derivative is 2 so again the power of this is 1 just like this power is 1 here the power is also 1 here is no product here this is independent variable x square is an independent variable y is dependent variable so there is no product between derivative of dependent variable and y so this, that's why this is again a linear function linear differential equation here third example d2y by dx2 highest order is second its power is 3 so that's why this is a non linear differential equation again, uh, also here y raised to the power 1 by 2 half so here the highest order derivative is 2 and it, it this is having a power 3 that's why this is a non linear od fine now to sometimes we are unable to solve a given differential equation fine in that case we need some another method some another method or another approach to solve it and numerical method is one of them so solution of a differential equation so this is the procedure how to solve the differential equation in general this is the existing deterministic method so here we ha you have already aware about this is a linear differential equation just take y in the in the so you can rewrite this as dy by y is equals to minus dx then integrate it so you will get y raised to the power minus x plus c now there is a question is it unique no to get unique solution we need one condition to get the unique solution of this because this is an arbitrary constant so you need one condition fine so just know that condition or substitute that sol value and you will get the required solution now this is the canonical form of a differential equation canonical form of a differential equation of the form 1 what is 1 this is 1 can be written as this highest order derivative is written here and rest of the thing is in the right hand side so this is the canonical form fine so this is another example d2y by dx2 is plus 4y is equals to 0 after solving this using deterministic method we have this y is equals to cos 2x plus c so here you can see is it unique solution no to get unique solution how many derivatives highest order derivative is 2 so that's why we need two conditions here the highest derivative is 1 so we need only one condition here the highest derivative is 2 so we need two conditions fine now that these conditions may be either given at single point or may be at two different points ये दो कंडीशन किसी एक पॉइंट पे भी दी जा सकती हैं और दो अलग अलग पॉइंट पे भी दी जा सकती हैं फाइन सो नाउ इफ ऑल द कंडीशंस आर गिवन एट ए वन पॉइंट 
at one point of the independent variable then equations is known as initial conditions and if the conditions are given at more than one point of the independent then this is called the boundary condition ठीक अगर कंडीशन एक ही पॉइंट पर दी जाएंगी तो इनिशियल कंडीशन है और एक से ज्यादा पॉइंट पर दी जाएंगी तो बाउंड्री कंडीशन दीज आर द एग्जांपल्स सेम प्रॉब्लम सेकेंड डेरिवेटिव ऑफ वाई प्लस टू वाई डैश प्लस वाई इज इक्वल टू इज टू दावर माइनस टू एक्स हियर इज ऑल्सो सेम इक्वेशन वाई टू सेकेंड डेरीवेटिव प्लस टू वाई डैश प्लस वाई इक्वल टू इज टू दावर माइनस बोथ आर सेम हाउ आर द डिफरेंस इन द कंडीशन हियर देर आर टू कंडीशन बिकॉज हाइएस्ट ऑर्डर डेरीवेटिव इज टू so we need two conditions and both these conditions are given at zero zero and zero here is y here is first derivative of y so y at zero is one first derivative of y at zero is two point five but both these are given at zero however here y at zero is one y at two is one point five so both are different point here is zero here is two both are different that's why this is boundary value problem this is an initial value dono condition zero pe given hai to initial hai dono कंडीशन अलग अलग पॉइंट पे गिवन है जीरो और टू पे तो ये बाउंड्री पहली प्रॉब्लम है फाइन नाउ एनालिटिकल सॉल्यूशन ऑफ ओडी एनालिटिकल सॉल्यूशन सो एनालिटिकल सॉल्यूशन टू ओडी आर अवेलेबल फॉर लीनियर ओडी एंड स्पेशल क्लास ऑफ नॉन लीनियर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन सो वी हैव वी कैन सॉल्व वी कैन सॉल्व स्पेसिफिक क्लास ऑफ प्रॉब्लम बट फॉर एग्जाम्पल दिस दिस इज डिफिकल्ट टू सॉल्व दिस टाइप ऑफ ओडी बाई एनालिटिकल मैथड If you are, if you want to solve this equation, then this is very difficult to solve this equation. And you can see, you can see, uh, you can check yourself. You are unable to solve this. In that case, numerical solution is a good option to find out the solution. Fine. Now here, numerical methods are used to obtain a graph or a table of the unknown function of y. So in the numerical solution, generally. either we are getting the points then we can join all these points and we get the approximate pattern of the solution fine or we are having a graph we are having graph or table to find out the solution fine the most of the numerical methods actually used to solve od are based directly or indirectly on the truncated taylor series expansion that means numerical method generally depends upon taylor series expansion fine now here are two types of numerical methods to solve ode one is single step methods another one is multiple step methods what is single step methods for example here you want to find out xi plus 1 xi minus 1 here you want to find out y y at i minus xi minus 1 you want to find out y at xi minus 1 so to find out this you need previous data you need only previous data y at xi minus 1 2 yani y at i minus 1 agar nikalna hai to y at xi minus 2 ki zarurat padegi similarly agar y at xi nikalna hai to sirf y at xi minus 1 ki zarurat padegi keval ek step purane ki zarurat padti hai data ki then this type of methods is known as single step methods fine but here you will see that here to find out the value at xi plus 1 y at xi plus 1 so you need y at xi you need y at xi minus 1 in dono ki zarurat padegi aapko isko calculate karane mein so this is two step method similarly you may construct three step method and so on multi step methods to ye jitne bhi data pass data ki zarurat padegi those are called as multi step methods जितने की जरूरत पड़ेगी वो उतने स्टेप का मेथड फॉर एग्जांपल अगर इतने की पड़ती है तो टू स्टेप तीनों की जरूरत पड़ती है तो थ्री स्टेप एंड सो ऑन सो जस्ट लाइक हियर दिस इज अ थ्री स्टेप मेथड बिकॉज दिस टू कंप्यूट वाई आई प्लस वन वी नीड वाई आई वाई आई माइनस वन एंड वाई आई माइनस टू सो दिस इज थ्री स्टेप मैथड फाइन नाउ कंपेरिजन ऑफ सिंगल स्टेप एंड मल्टी स्टेप मैथड्स द सिंगल स्टेप मैथड्स use only previous computation results however multi step methods used several past computation just like here computed by another method fine the major disadvantage of single step method is that they use many more evaluations of the derivative to attain the same degree of accuracy compared with the multi step method so here in single step methods basically we have uh, this advantage that to get more accuracy 
यूज मैनी मोर इवेल्युएशन फाइन वी वी नीड मैनी मोर इवेल्युएशन टू गेट द एक्यूरेसी बट इन मल्टी स्टेप मैथड्स वी गेट दिस एक्यूरेसी मच मोर फास्टर सेम डिग्री ऑफ एक्यूरेसी कंपेयर विद द मल्टी स्टेप मैथड्स फाइन सो दिस इज द एडवांटेज एंड डिसएडवांटेज नाउ numerical methods there is a note numerical methods will yield the solution of the od in one of the two forms first a series for y in terms of power of x that means on in terms of taylor series in terms of taylor series so this is the picard's method and taylor series method similarly here a set of or in the form of tables so either you got get the solution in series or either in the table form so these are the methods so these are the list of methods here we will discuss only taylor series method picard's method euler's method euler's modified method runge kutta method and milli predictor character method we will not consider this adams batch fourth and so fine so we will consider only these six methods fine thank you